we look, we find more indications that the United States is in a lot of trouble. America's domestic supply chains have been broken, and disruptions continue to pile on, causing more shortages and exacerbating price increases all over the nation. Our system has never been so vulnerable to external interruptions, and experts say the United States is extremely vulnerable to cyber attacks. At a time, nearly all services and operations that make the economy run are heavily dependent on technology. To make things worse, our financial markets are starting to falter, with the stock market recording billions in losses week after week, and the housing market bubble is on the verge of another disastrous burst. On top of all that, we're in the middle of the worst energy supply shortage of this country, and the lack of enough fuel and electricity is resulting in a historic manufacturing slowdown and a sharp collapse in food production. All of that is occurring at the same time as our geopolitical conflicts with other major economies continues to escalate. Many more problems continue to emerge with each passing day, and the things we just mentioned are not even half of the story. That's why in today's video, we've brought you a compilation of stats, forecasts, and updated numbers about the issues our country is currently facing and the challenges we're about to face in the months ahead. But before checking this list, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our future videos. Without further ado, here are 15 facts that prove that America is in deep, deep trouble. 1. Supply Chain Crisis The U.S. supply chain is still in chaos, and it's getting worse. Major ports on the West Coast, which used to operate like clockwork, are now beset by delays, with container ships queuing for days and some of the worst congestion ever recorded. A recent report showed that the country's two largest U.S. ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach are actually the least efficient trade hubs for handling containers in the entire world. During the 2021 holiday season, supply chain executives said that the backlog of container ships looked like a freeway in traffic. Now, as the port of Shanghai reopens and massive loads of goods are headed for U.S. ports, our supply chains are expected to face many more challenges. Disruptions and congestion as peak shipping season approaches. 2. Consumer and commodity price inflation with consumer prices over 8% higher than a year ago, growing affordability constraints are putting immense pressure on the finances of millions of American families, while household incomes remain stagnant. Despite Fed policies to tame inflation, consumer prices are going to remain elevated this year due to the soaring costs of housing, energy, and food as the global commodity market faces shortages of energy supplies, raw materials, fertilizers, grains, and semiconductors. 3. Cyber Attacks The U.S. aging infrastructure is at extreme risk of suffering cyber attacks. According to Kathy Jones, Managing Director and Chief Fixed Income Strategist for the Center for Financial Research, this oftentimes is an overlooked problem. But that doesn't mean that the systems aren't vulnerable to external disruptions. We seem to have gone and through quite a few of them over the past few years without huge disruption. But it worries me that the risk doesn't get that much attention in the markets, Jones said. In fact, the organization ranked cyber-related issues as a top risk that U.S. businesses will face over the next decade. A significant attack could take down the government and banking functions and could hinder economic growth. Such an attack would likely cause a steep decline in stocks and normal market functions could be jeopardized, Jones alerted. 4. Food Production Collapse The American food supply chain is in a severe crisis right now. A crisis that could be reflected on grocery store shelves and wallets by the summer. This warning comes from farmer John Boyd Jr., the president of the National Black Farmers Association. He reveals that poor planting weather across much of the country, higher prices on seeds, higher prices on fertilizer, and higher prices on fuel 
plus supply chain issues are taking a heavy toll on farmers who are abandoning their crops at a frightening pace. He said, we're going to see a lot of empty shelves and a lot more higher prices. According to Bank of America, the inflation rate for food is expected to continue its historic rise through the end of the year. Bank of America analysts, led by Alexander Lin, said in a note on Thursday that they expect U.S. food prices to rise another 9% before the end of 2022. 5. Manufacturing Slowdown The U.S. economy has been in a productivity depression for more than a decade, suffering from a historically unprecedented slowdown in labor productivity growth. In April, U.S. factory activity faced the worst slowdown in one and a half years, Reuters reported. The decline occurred amid a rise in workers quitting their jobs and manufacturers are becoming more anxious about supply chain problems. The weakness in manufacturing has now infected the services side of the U.S. economy, noted Peter Bukva, chief investment officer at Bleakley Advisory Group. And now, the effects of this decline are threatening to ripple through other sectors of the economy. 6. Energy Crisis On top of everything we've already mentioned, should we add a diesel fuel shortage and a nationwide electricity shortage to the equation? We're actually being warned that energy supplies are rapidly dwindling in America, and a shocking diesel shortage could begin this summer. According to Daniel Jurgen, the vice chairman of IHS Market, this could be the worst crisis since the Arab oil embargo and the Iranian Revolution in the 1970s. At the same time, power grid operators are warning that insufficient capacity will result in rolling blackouts in the coming weeks and months, so we better be ready to face soaring energy prices and an energy crisis that is unlike anything we have ever witnessed. 7. Civil Disorder According to data from the Civil Unrest Index projections, the United States is amongst the 75 countries that will likely experience a surge in civil disorder by late 2022. Over the past 12 months, America has seen its standing on the index sharply deteriorate, falling from the 91st riskiest jurisdiction in the Civil Unrest Index in the second quarter of 2020 to the 34th most by the fourth quarter of 2021. Social unrest rates will likely continue to remain significantly elevated compared to historic trends over the next two years. The increase in demonstrations is expected to be primarily driven by food insecurity and the erosion of mechanisms that have historically defused tensions. We expect the surge in instability to take place against a backdrop of a painful post-pandemic economic recovery that will likely inflame existing public dissatisfaction with the government, the researchers wrote. 8. Another Health Crisis Virologists are warning that monkeypox has become a hypermutated virus as it continues to spread to more U.S. states. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention has confirmed 25 cases of monkeypox across 10 U.S. states with at least two genetically distinct monkeypox variants circling across the country. Experts are weighing various possible explanations for the quick growth of the current outbreaks. It could be that a few events simply gave the virus a chance to spread, or monkeypox may have evolved to get better at human-to-human -human transmission. A third hypothesis is that the virus may have been spreading undetected for some time. In any case, another health emergency could bring back lockdowns, spark widespread business shutdowns, and result in mass layoffs once again. 9. Extreme Weather Wildfires, hurricanes, tornadoes, winter storms, and heat waves were among the 20 weather and climate disasters the United States has faced over the past 12 months. Those extreme weather events have resulted in $145 billion in damages in 2021 and victimized 688 people. 
Such disasters are becoming more frequent with each passing year, and it's estimated that more than 100 million people in the U.S. will experience temperatures that are 20 to 30 degrees above average this summer. Scientists say there's reason to expect even more menacing extreme weather disasters in 2022. And we're set to experience the worst drought in history, according to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. 10. Stock Market Crash Stocks have witnessed a terrible start of the year, with major indexes entering bear market territory, including the S&P, which is down over 20%, and NASDAQ plummeting by almost 30% so far. However, several indicators are pointing out that the correction isn't over yet. In fact, investors are becoming more concerned about the economic growth outlook and have started pulling back from risky parts of the market that are sensitive to inflation and rising interest rates. This is a recipe for a troubled macroeconomic environment. According to Wall Street's fear gauge signal, the sell-off could accelerate in the second half of 2022 as economic and financial problems compound. 11. Housing Bubble Burst Over the past two years, the U.S. housing market has experienced a historic boom, with home prices jumping 34.4% since 2020 and 19.8% over the past year alone. But now, even Fed researchers are worried about an impending bust. In a paper titled, Real-Time Market Monitoring Find Signs of Brewing U.S. Housing Bubble, the Dallas Fed researchers found that home prices were becoming detached from economic fundamentals. And according to a study conducted by the Florida Atlantic University, many regional housing markets could soon see a full-blown correction. Many markets are priced exorbitantly compared to their historical average, they wrote. Every one of America's 100 largest housing markets is overpriced relative to what economic fundamentals in the market would support, the study found. At least 90 out of the nation's 100 largest housing markets are overpriced by 10% or more. That includes 44 markets overpriced by at least 30% and 13 overpriced by at least 50%. 12. Conflict with Russia Geopolitical strategists are getting increasingly worried about the potential escalation of the conflict between the United States and Russia. Russian officials have indicated that the U.S. is crossing the very red lines they have avoided until now. For the first two months of the conflict between Russia and Ukraine, the federal government has refused to authorize any military support, but now some observers worry that with the additional aid sent to Ukraine and tougher economic sanctions imposed on Russia, the U.S. president is forcing Putin into a corner in which he can only fight or surrender. In the Kremlin's eyes, the West is out to get Russia. It was unspoken before. Now it's spoken, said Sean Monaghan, an expert at the Center for Strategic and International Studies. Similarly, George Beebe, a former geopolitical strategist, said that the Biden administration may be in danger of forgetting that the most important national interest that the United States has is avoiding a nuclear conflict with Russia. The Russians have the ability to make sure everyone else loses if they lose too. And that may be where we're heading. It's a dangerous corner to turn, he cautioned. 13 conflict with China. America may also enter into a conflict with China if the Chinese government invades Taiwan. In fact, during a press conference earlier this year, one reporter asked Biden he didn't want to get involved in the Ukraine conflict militarily for obvious reasons. Are you willing to get involved militarily to defend Taiwan if it comes to that? Yes, Biden replied. You are? The reporter pressed. That's the commitment we made, the president said. Not long after that, the U.S. president apologized, saying he misunderstood the question. But the damage was already done, and the Chinese were furious. 
On issues concerning China's sovereignty and territorial integrity and other core interests, there is no room for compromise, warned Wang Wenbin, a spokesman for the Chinese foreign ministry. We urge the U.S. side to earnestly follow the One China principle, be cautious in words and deeds on the Taiwan issue, and not send any wrong signal to pro-Taiwan independence and separatist forces, so it won't cause serious damage to the situation across the Taiwan Strait and China-U.S. relations," he alerted. 14. Policy Mistake The U.S. economy is at risk of drowning as the Fed starts to taper its bond purchasing program. According to Edward Moyer, a senior market analyst with OANDA, the foreign exchange research and brokerage company, the greatest risk facing the U.S. economy is a policy mistake by the Federal Reserve. The central bank has started fighting inflation with a series of rate hikes that could trigger another economic downturn, he explains. On the same note, the head of equity strategy at Wisdom Tree Asset Management, Jeff Winninger, predicts that the Fed is going to hike rates six more times this year, a very risky move in an environment of higher gasoline, goods and services prices. This could result in a massive decline in consumer spending and another economic slowdown by the end of 2022, the financial experts warned. And 15. Economic Recession Recessions are incredibly hard to predict, and even forecasters like the Fed only know we're experiencing a recession once we're in one, not in advance, argues Tara Sinclair, an economics professor at the George Washington University. In general, policymakers underweight recessions in their forecasts and focus on predicting the economy in normal times. A recession can be described as a significant decline in economic activity that spread across the economy and that lasts more than a few months. The current outlook suggests that a confluence of shocks will plunge the already troubled U.S. economy into another historical recession. According to Krishna Kua, the vice chair of Evercore ISI, there is a much higher than normal risk that the tough talk from officials, economists, and market participants would become a self-fulfilling prophecy and generate a downturn. We're in another recession scare now, except this time we think it's for real, he alerts. With all that said, it is clear that we're going to face unprecedented challenges in the coming months on top of all the problems we're already coping with. America is in deep trouble. We are in deep trouble. And dark clouds continue to emerge on the horizon, signaling that a grim future seems to be coming for us. Thank you for watching this video. Please share it with family and friends, and please subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell.